It was an emotional day for Greg Busby as he learned his sentencing today. He will spend the next 7 to 15 years in prison after police say that he gave his infant grandson morphine and Benadryl. 60-year-old Greg Busby hung his head as officers rolled him into the courtroom to learn his punishment in the death of his grandson. I'm just sorry. I'm very sorry it happened. An apology that the family of one-year-old Antonio Garcia Lazarski feels may never be enough. It was a terrible thing. I mean, it was... I just don't know how to put it any worse than that. It was, it was a terrible act. I don't, I don't think... Uh, I don't think it's anything I'll, I'll ever live down. I don't even know if I want to. Busby was charged with involuntary manslaughter after a babysitting tragedy on February 10th. Investigators say young Antonio was in the care of his grandparents while his mother was out of town. That morning when Antonio's grandmother went to check on him, she found the infant unresponsive. Toxicology reports revealed a lethal dose of morphine and Benadryl in the infant system. Busby told the court he only wanted to calm his grandson, not harm him. Children are precious. Life is sacred. Those realities were overlooked in the uh, conduct you demonstrated and the actions you took, which caused the death of this one-year-old baby. This isn't Busby's first run-in with the law. He previously spent 20 years in prison for check fraud. From Grand Rapids, Fox 17, this is Jonas Lawson.